Hey everyone, it's Sara and Ricky here filling in for Drew on Audiophile Tech Tips. And this mm. week we are going to be talking about Bluetooth. Now, I did not have a huge amount of experience with wireless headphones until I reviewed the new Focal Bathys recently and I was pretty much blown away. And I was like, what happened to this idea that wireless is never gonna sound as good as wired? So Ricky, who has a little more knowledge in this yeah, area, is one. gonna give us the rundown and why wireless headphones more and more are sounding just as good as wired connections. Some would say that's debatable, but well, I think yes, I think but... for most people, uh, you know, apart from the hardcore audio files, that's typically going to be the case. You know, you're not going to be able to hear, you know, if if you're transmitting high resolution audio across Bluetooth 5.2 using LDAC high res codecs, mm -hmm. yeah, most people aren't really going to be able to tell the difference between a wired or a wireless um, sound quality. So again, when it comes to Bluetooth, let's just touch base real quick. So essentially what Bluetooth does, it takes the audio file, it compresses it, it sends it across using the codec to the receiving uh, headphone or whatever. Okay, and each codec has a different algorithm, has a different transmission speed. So a lot of those things are gonna you know, play into effect of how the sound, how the music is gonna sound when it comes out. And name some of these codecs for me. So typical codecs, you have your standard SBC, which is compatible with everything, AAC, you have your Aptex, Aptex HD, Aptex LL for low latency, uh, LDAC, I mean, those are just some of, the, some of the main ones out there that most people are gonna be able to use, so. And LDAC's the, the, the proprietary Sony, Sony one, right? Sony created LDAC. Um, it's probably one of the best mm -hmm. high-resolution codecs um, as far as the algorithm goes, the sound quality that comes out, the transmission speed is really good for um, large, large, fi large high-resolution files. So the Sony XM5 headphone, of course, does have LDAC because it is, of course, developed by Sony. And I know that non-Sony products can support LDAC. Correct. So the Sennheiser Momentum 4 and the Focal Batiste. They do not actually they support do not. them. So okay. it's, it, again, it depends on the manufacturer and what codecs they want to implement in their products. So uh, Sennheiser, again, all of these do SBC and AAC. Uh, Sennheiser does Aptex, I think, just regular Aptex. And then I think the Batiste does all the Aptexes, right? Two of them, I think. Two of them? Okay. So again, it just depends on what the manufacturer wants to use, how it works. So if you want all the numbers on codex, sample rate, bit rate, bit depth, be sure to check out our website. There we have a guide on high res music. So check that out. Sar, so is there anything else? Yeah, if you would like a personal recommendation on the wireless headphone that's right for you, drop a comment below or leave us a comment at moon-audio.com slash contact dash us. So let us know in the comments, what do you guys think about Bluetooth? Do you have Bluetooth headphones? Remember to subscribe so you don't miss all of our videos and reviews. And as always, thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching.